Hi everyone, welcome to another video. Today we're talking about Williams presenting us new car for 2020. Of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. New car from Williams. Uh, first of all, just wow. This, uh, I didn't expect livery this beautiful after that ugly car from last year. I mean, I can say that. It was just like plain white. This year they will at least have a beautiful livery. Uh, last year they were slow and they were ugly, which was for the fans of Williams, uh, really sorry for you. Uh, last year was not an easy year. But what is the thing with this new car, or is it a new car? Is This is actually development of last year's car. So this is, yeah, we cannot expect Williams to fight for any good positions this year. This concept is just evolution of last year's car. Last year's car really had some major issues. As director of design Doug McKernan said, they had problems with brakes, they had problems with uh, weight of the car, so basically some basic stuff was not really up to standards and this year they really need to they really need to at least cover cover those basic basic needs of the car uh, Adam Carter uh, head engineer said they only did evolution of last year's car because it's they just didn't have enough budget they needed to relocate budget to some other sectors some other areas of development and they are probably building car for 2021 uh, it's really the there is nothing to gain for them. Ah, uh, new signing Latifi. Uh, well, he brought some money with him, that's for sure. Uh, here we see Lavazza. Uh, that's because of him. His father is billionaire in Canada, and this will probably help them, but not this year. This year will still they will still struggle, I reckon. Um, and also they have uh, they went to Barcelona along with Renault and Haas uh, for filming day uh, as each team has only 100 kilometers of running and with reduced testing this year uh, teams really need every mile every kilometer uh, under their belt so yeah give me your thoughts what do you think? Well, will Williams improve or will they still be at the back of the grid as last year? Uh, see you next time.